and in business, government needs to do more to ensure that projects already allocated and budgets get completed for the overall benefit of the citizenry. This advice was given by Action Aid Nigeria at uh, Capacity Building for Young People on Budget Monitoring and Tracking. Justice Akandoi tells us more in this report. Budget is perhaps the most important instrument for the development of any modern state, apart from the constitution. Arguably, it is only through the instrumentality of it that government can allocate resources to deliver services to the people, especially the poor and excluded. However, in Nigeria, blockages, including lack of participation of citizens and effective tracking of the implementation, non-access to budget document and regular report by government are key issues hampering effectiveness. Go and serve people in Abuja, and then you speak with oil, right? At this workshop, emphasis has been placed on carrying the young people along. Yes, there are a lot of budgets. Uh, there are a lot of projects that are being carried out by government and many of us are not tracking where those budgets are coming from. Many of us don't know where those budgets, how much budget are in mark for each of the projects. We only see road construction, we only see school buildings, we only see um, ongoing projects in the state. But many of us don't know how much was, in, was initially budgeted for such projects. Um, if you look at what is happening in Nigeria today, we have to be deliberate in ensuring that young people get involved in whatever that is happening in the society, be it in election, in public finance engagement, in governance, in accountability. Despite the launch of the Open Treasury Portal in 2019, aimed at boosting financial transparency in the country, Analysts say that the federal government and its agencies continue to breach its own standard as it has not kept up with efficient and timely publishing of statements. On a scale of 1 to 10, I will give it a 4. And the reason is because there is um, lack of openness, there is lack of um, engagement as well. Governments at all levels, whether at the federal, at the state, particularly at the subnational level, they have not been very open in showing the books. Um, with the whole engagement by civil society. So we have the budget documents and then the whole essence is also to track. So I will see that there is a level of uh, transparency and improvement. However, they need to do more. They need to do more to ensure that um, budgets or projects that are already allocated for in the budget to ensure that there should be a completion status. For the young people, they say the time has come to get more involved if desired changes can be achieved. When we are aware of what budget has been created and the importance of this budget, then we're able to track the progress using the necessary methods and the necessary tools and then also advocate for the right implementation of this budget. Engaging people, engaging the stakeholders, we are Collective action is number one. Then, like I said, we start engaging the stakeholders, the government, um, um, demanding for accountability, be it at the state level, federal level, or local government. The consensus here is that there is need to promote citizens' engagement in the entire budget cycle, from selection of project through implementation to monitoring and evaluation, while citizens' groups should work more closely with the legislature and the media to ensure effective tracking, monitoring, and oversight. Justin Akadonye, Plus TV News, Lagos. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.